West Texas and Abilene Christian. It's a pretty big robbery. Uh, just two teams, two great teams, year in and year out, gonna have elite players. Uh, just like you look over the past couple years, you got NFL type players on each team with Johnny Knox, Bernard Scott, Edmund Gates, you got Charlie Martin, uh, Keith Noel for West Texas, uh, and uh, even Keith Dunn Fleming. Some great players that came through both programs and just keep that rivalry going. It's been it's been great. When you talk about the rivalry, it's like any other game this week. Uh, but when you play as somebody that is as good as they are, like the Lone Star Conference South, but West Texas in particular, it makes it brings out the best in your guys. So. It's kind of like when we go up to Kimbro to play, it's like we get pumped. And when we are at home, it's like they get pumped to come to Abilene to play us. And it's kind of like all right, it's going to be a big crowd at both stadiums. You feel like all right, we got home field advantage, but over the last couple years, it hasn't been that way with both teams winning at each other's home field. But Hopefully, it'll be a change of scenery and we can get that win this year. Like I say, they'll come in pump, ready to play. Uh, we just got to match their intensity, and our guys have worked hard all week. So we just got to keep keep it up and stay focused and just not get too overhyped and not try to win pregame and just stay calm, and we'll be okay. We'll be okay. It's going to be a big crowd at both stadiums. You feel like all right, we got home field advantage, but over the last couple years, it hasn't been that way with both teams winning at each other's home field. But hopefully it'll be a change of scenery and we can get that win this year. But we just got to match their intensity, and our guys have worked hard all week. So we just got to keep keep it up and stay focused and just not get too overhyped and not try to win pregame and just stay calm. and. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. West Texas is a very good football team. And Our guys are going to say, hey, it's, it's another game, which it is, but it's fun to be able to compete against somebody that's as good as they are because it makes you better. You know, So you've got to be sharp when you're prepared. You've got to be able to uh, show up and, and, and play well. Ultimately, you just you have to go into a game and, and uh, you have to execute your game plan. And so, you know, it, it, it's uh, that's what they're doing. They're not really worried too much about what we have in our schemes. They're worried about getting them better. So are we. But uh, it's fun. It's just those guys know. I mean, it's they know it's a it's going to be a fun football game. And uh, and if you go all the way back to even 2001, these games, even when West Texas was below 500 team and ACU in the early 2000s. Every one of these games have been close. You don't know who's going to win it until the clock ticks zero. And that's that's just a – you go to college, you play football to be a part of big-time games, and that's what this is. So it'll be a fun experience for everybody. For me, just personally, there's a lot of uh, carryover because that was – that guy gave me – my Coach Carthel gave me my first job. So I've been a part of that for a long time. And the defense coordinator, Colby Carthel, was actually one of my closest friends here when he was a coach here. Uh, so I, and I know a lot of those people uh, up there. So it's personal. It's, it's fun to compete against people. Uh, it's fun to compete against people that you know personally. It just kind of brings out the best in you for that week.